So the real purpose of rat tickling is to generate this positive, happy mental state um, in rats. And when we tickle them, they can produce these calls, which we can hear using a bat microphone. They're out of our range of hearing. And they also produce these calls during other positive experiences, what we think they're having a good time, so playing or during a food reward. So just like human tickling, tickling involves rapid finger movement on different parts of the body. As with when rats play, they kind of rough and tumble wrestle with each other. What the experimenter tries to do is to flip the rat over and tickle the tummy. The rat's allowed to flip back whenever it wants. So animal welfare is particularly important. We're now looking at animals having a positive experience as well as a negative experience. So we want to make sure that animals have what we call a good life and that's becoming really popular within the government and also is very important to our consumers as well. Lots of studies have shown that tickling is good for welfare and can help reduce anxiety in rats um, and it's really helping with new experiences and handling. So when we tickle them, we also look at their responses in their behaviour as well. So whether they want to come and interact with the, the handler, your hand, um, and also these vocalisations that they produce, and that's how we measure whether they're in a more positive state.